in the kitchen again, guys, as I explained to you earlier about making the oven lamb inside of the oven today. Right here, I have a few pieces of lamb. Um, basically, as you can see, I got the lamb chops and I got the also uh, the boneless part of the lamb. Um, explain it to you, guys. We're gonna show you how you cook lamb and get flavors from lamb. Um, right here, I have. White onion, spring onion, some fresh thyme, and some carrot, and some ginger and garlic. Pour it straight inside of the bowl like this. I'm using a large white onion, guys, just to get the flavor from it. That's why I'm using so much onion inside of it. Nice and lovely. So, as you can see, exactly what I'm talking about right here. Then, put a pinch of a soy sauce. Coast pepper. Let the lamb rest. So first of all, I have to make sure marinating me right and proper way. We're gonna put a little bit of soy sauce. No, some sweet chili sauce. Not too much. Let me show you. You can get flavors from lamb when you cook it. And then next thing, I have some lamb season. The lamb season got every kind of flavors where you can think of. You got um, um, you got. All kind of those season where you expect you want to put on the lamb is inside of the lamb season. So I'm gonna put a teaspoon of that also. Just a teaspoon. Nice one. And then um, next we're gonna put some paprika. Teaspoon of paprika. Lovely and nice. And then next we're gonna put some all-purpose season, a teaspoon of all-purpose season just to get a flavor from it and a teaspoon of everyday seasoning uh, basically you can use your kind of season where you normally use to marinate your lamb at home but I'm just explaining to you how you can marinate your lamb and get the flavors from it guys I'm gonna put a teaspoon of vegetable oil also lovely and nice then all the seasoned and stuff you see i put on the lamb is to get the lamb marinated guys and get the flavors in the lamb you know what i mean when you cook lamb you have to be careful because you know what i mean lamb come with that strong scent so you have to get rid of that scent um basically the sweet chili sauce is ginger which gonna help to kill it and the soy sauce lovely and nice so marinate it just like this Rub him up and get in all of those flavor and things inside of the lamb. With the lamb, we're gonna serve it with some mashed potato. And I know you're gonna love it. Alright? Lovely and nice. Basically, you can you can marinate the lamb and put it down for a nice good two hours before you, you cook it. But today we're not gonna waste the time. We're gonna got the lamb already rest. So all we need to do is cook it now. Then straight inside of this oven tray right here wow oh, look at that man that's beautiful really nice guys look at this inside of this oven tray we're gonna put it in the oven preheat the oven first you get all of those seasoning on top of it cover the lamb with it guys Look at that guys, that is beautiful, really nice. Straight inside of the oven, bake it for a nice good half an hour inside of the oven. If not, give it a couple more minutes, guess mark 7 is good for it. Put it in the middle of the oven, not on the top shelf because the top shelf is going to make it burn. You don't want to burn up your lamb, you want your lamb to cook. Um, and a tender, really nice and soft, smooth, soup, smooth cooking. Very good for it. So enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, and this is the best way you can marinate the lamb, get some flavor in the lamb, guys. And we're gonna serve it with some mashed potato. You're gonna bring up his own gravy, and that gravy which you're gonna use for it. So guys, enjoy it, and leave your comments. Thank you so much.
want to. So I just take it from the oven, guys, and I want to look at it to see it. the way the lamb look. Wow, look at that lovely gravy where she's, it, it just bring up that lovely, nice gravy. Let's spin them over to the other side. Get the flavor in it right out of this lamb. Oh my god, I know you guys are gonna love this one. This is the steak lamb oven roast, and we're gonna go with some potato. So, what we're gonna simply do, I just boil off some potato, and I'm gonna simply put the potato them on top of it like this because I want the potato them to get roast. So, we're gonna put the potato them on top of it just like that, guys. Beautiful, really nice. And as I said to you guys, you're gonna love this one because this is just, just something totally different, and I know you guys will love it. Um, you don't have to go with potato, you can use whatever you like and, and 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 use inside of this nice lovely oven roast lamb guys as I said before it just amazing to do such a such a recipe like this guys as you can see I removed the skin from the potato earlier and I simple just get it marinate up my meat and you know what I mean get it cooked off just put a little butter inside of it just to bring in some flavor and some taste inside of it so as you can see exactly what i'm coming from as you can see hopefully you guys will love it and enjoy the recipe i'm gonna put it back inside of the oven for a nice good 30 to 35 more yeah, sorry guys <laughs> about 30 to 35 more minutes. another 20 more minutes inside of the oven and that's time the potato them might get ready so as you can see really nice and lovely and hopefully you guys will love it i'm gonna put it back in the oven for 20 more minutes and as i said lamb and potato goes really really good so enjoy it nice one just take it from the oven just a minute ago mm. look at this beautiful and nice this is the lamb mm -mm. look at that guys beautiful With the roast, with the potato. This is marvelous. And I'm telling you, if you don't know what Chef Ricardo been talking about, this is it right here. Mmm. Look at that guys, that is beautiful, really nice. So as you can see exactly what me is all about right here in the kitchen with Chef Ricardo cooking program guys. It's amazing, it is amazing. So what we're gonna do now, let's see something right here. So right here we got the cucumber, we got the tomato, we got the lamb and everything looking lovely and fine and nice. So as you can see, I might just put another slices of tomato right on it. And uh, two more pieces of a cucumber, and that's look lovely and nice, healthy dish, really nice oven bake, lamb steak and potato, really nice. So enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel, and leave your comments. Thank you so much for watching the cooking program. As we say, we have a lot more recipe like this for you. See you next time. Bye bye.